YouTube is a wonderful place. And that's lower wicked. Big yeah. I need to get my video this is right there, say huh? Hall. Oh anyways. <laughs> Top five of our favorite cartoons that are no longer on and we're angry about not to be on. But yeah, this is ridiculous. But anyways, this is part one in a, in a possible series, and part two, if this is, this is a series, is gonna be um. If you wanted to be serious. Yeah, part two, if this is a series, will be our favorite cartoon that are all on TV that they're making episodes of still, and then part three, if this is a series will be our favorite cartoons of all time on with new episodes or old 16 years ago. And this, this series will also have games uh, in the, it's like a top 5, top 10 thing, but this episode is top 5. So we're going to start with top, with number 5. Alright, so number 5 is yours. Take it away. How do I pause it? It's going. Yeah, I didn't pause it. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Number five, Bakugan. Alright, that's Bakugan. Bakugan, think about Pokemon and Beyblade, if you know what those are, if you don't, if you don't you've know been what po- out, you've been if a you only know what Pokemon is, please just let me come see you and just let me slap you. You've been living under a cold desert rock. But, and Beyblade, I can understand, Beyblade wasn't a big thing, but it was, but it wasn't. But just put those together and just add and replace the bay place with balls. Why are you showing my case? Boom, I just made the vision clearer. Totally. But throwing balls and when they were kinda like monsters. Kinda like Digimon was. Or yeah, but you wait still. <laughs> but I just love the show because there's like every other freaking show in the world, action and drama. Mainly more drama than anything, but pretty good action. And they actually lasted for a few years. Your turn. I don't know anything about that show. That's not your turn of a show. Oh, well, number four. Now, number four is Teen Titans. The original. Hold on, let me think. Yeah. Wait, didn't you say something before that? Uh, yeah, hold up. It was. <laughs> the, it was. Did you want or whatever you said? Teen was Titans. Backy gone, something. No, it was Teen Titans, and it was. Was it Johnny Chess? No. It was Teen Titans. No, it was Johnny Chess. No, it was Teen Titans. Because I said, cause I said Johnny Bravo earlier, and he said, yeah, Johnny Chess. Yeah, I know. Number four is Johnny. <laughs> number four is Johnny Chess. No. Johnny Chess. Johnny Chess was a really good job. So, what Johnny Chess was mainly about, it was this kid, and his name was Johnny Chess. He was a little kid. His name I was think Johnny. He was his last name was Test. His sisters were geniuses, and they literally had they literally had a, they had a lab. When I say a lab, I mean a whole lab with technical equipment and chemical equipment, and thermal equipment, and energy equipment, and they even had a teeth not really. But their dog could talk because their sister didn't experiment on it. Then there was her dad, and Johnny Test was just one of those shows you couldn't get enough of. It wasn't just for it wasn't random for the sake of being random. It was random for the sake of being epic. It was good action, drama, there's not much romance in it. There was just girls talking guys and guys fucking girls and, Damn, and very that. chubby little kids talking stuff stalking Sue. Jesus Christ, that was weird, that was cute and weird. And there was this one kid who was Johnny. And there was a lot there was a lot, there was a lot of bad guys. Like the bad guys were so constant and everything there was a talking cat. Mr. There, Williams. there was a yeah, there there was um and the bad guys and the good guys sometimes work together. And, um, um, Bing Bl- Bling Bling, which was the boy who was stalking Susan Tess, who was Johnny's sister, was also one of the on and off friends and enemies. He had his own island. He was super rich. Sometimes, yeah. Sometimes he was in his own island. Sometimes he was in his tower. I don't know. But Johnny Tess was one of those shows that was really good. So, without further ado, continue to a better show. And number three. 
Yeah. Oh. Number three. Number three. Teen Titans. The original, not Teen Titans Go to Titans Go Six. If I if I ever hear someone say Teen Titans Go is good. I will personally come to their house, shoot their mother, bury their father, kill their sister, eat their dog, and kick them to a hole. Are you part Chinese? <laughs> that was racist. I'm How can kidding. I say this? You're racist. I'm not racist. Why do you have my keys? This is my I keys. Those my... Oh my god, you're dumb. Yes, I am. But that's besides the point. But Teen Titans, the original, it was just action packed. It was basically the. It was anime, but for Cartoon Network. To me. Most cartoons were kind of like anime that you just cover the camera. Oh god. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Just keep going. Guys, what is he doing? I wish you could tell me, but what is going on? Just keep, t just keep going. <laughs> Do I look retarded? Is this zoomed up on my face? Guys, what is he doing? What did you do? What are you doing? Oh, you zoomed up on my face. Oh, can you hear the phone? I can Sorry, talk guys. Oh, right, talk about Teen Titans. Back in Teen Titans, after they had making me look stupid. Don't you do it again. I'll <laughs> break your fingers. Alright, I'll just take like three pictures like you got on my phone. Hey, that was an accent. But, Teen Titans just had mainly action. Kind of drama, a little bit of romance, but it was very romance, kind of like Johnny says. Okay, and the last thing. Teen Titans, I wish it lasted longer, because the way it ended was actually really sad. You're covering the camera. I'm right trying now. to hold it, because my hand cramped. <laughs> and I cut my yeah. fingertip off, so. And, I saw much else I can say, just how good it was, how design was just how they add DC thing like adults kind of like the adult vibe to it and all the characters had their own stories Robin came from Batman and Robin Robin made was the with team. the Robin was with the little Justice League which was Kid Flash and all them and came in to get in Cyborg that was actually the original Teen Titans which yeah. was Kid and then he came in to get in Cyborg and Beast Boy and Raven and with, and then when they went off Robin went off to be Nightwing. Cyborg went off to be Cyborg. on the Justice League. Beast Boy, I don't know where he went. Actually, no, he was on the Justice League before he joined Teen Titans. Who? Cyborg. Oh. Because Teen Titans didn't exist yet. And then Beast Boy, I don't know where he went to. And then Raven went off to be, a, I'm pretty sure, a goddess. Either a goddess or a demon. And Starfire went back to her, comic Starfire went back to her planet. I'm pretty sure. And she became the queen. Yeah. Either that or she stayed with them. Yeah. And guys, together with Robin. No, wait. It just depends what on what you're doing. About. Okay, so number two. Ever transition? Do 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 do. So I actually have the last two. Number two is Phineas and Ferb. Phineas and Ferb was. Are you sure we're on paused? Yes. This is one of those shows. They were just freaking awesome. We had, you had action. You had a little bit of romance mixed in there. You had comedy. You had miniature adult comedy mixed in there. You had freaking period of platypus and Dr. Doofenshmirtz mixed in the <laughs> shit with martial arts. Dr. Doofenshmirtz with his pine head looking so... Phineas, though. I'm pretty sure Phineas... I'm pretty sure Dr. Doofenshmirtz... Have you ever seen episodes where he looked forward? Oh, my God. You Phineas? He was like... <laughs> I don't know, but Phineas, your head though, looking like a Dorito, Locos, Tacos, look at ass, looking like a Ronnie. When you looked forward, it was hilarious. Anyways, but the show was good besides Penny, Penny looking like Penny. a freaking Dorito, and Ferb looking like a freaking rectangle and trying to get multiplied by two. What? <laughs> you think I'm pretty sure it's over the camera. Is your finger over the camera? Oh yeah, sorry guys. God damn it. Anyway, like you didn't do it. I did it on purpose though. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways, but Beauty's Fair was a good show. It had action. It was. That's one of those shows I would go back and watch. And they had, we actually were just watching a commercial about it. Where they were saying, the creators were saying, 
we just we just finished finished for her we're done with it it's over we ended it hope it was good and then they said but are we taking a break no then they created Milo Murphy's Law which is one of my which is one of my new favorite shows is freaking awesome it's freaking amazing I've only seen like part of one of the episodes huh I've only seen like part of one of the episodes like when the egg thing egg episode yeah like what I'm not gonna explain that show I'm going to explain Milo Murphy's Law briefly because it's the exact same creators and the exact same studio with most of the stuff, with, um, the same people who played Phineas and Ferb are still in it. Um. Imagine if they actually came in in one episode. That would be awesome. I'm pretty sure it's the same universe, but what my Murphy's Law is, is, is Murphy's Law is that anything that could go wrong will go wrong. I'm not going to explain that show. That's gonna anything be you business. survive will make you late to school. And anything that doesn't kill you will make you late Whatever doesn't make you late. We'll, whatever doesn't kill you will make you late for school. But we're going to explain that in a different video. But Fantasy Fair was a good show, good creators, good audience, good. It was all around, aiming for audience of any age, in my opinion. It was a show that I would go back and watch a million times over and over and over. Especially Perry the Platypus. Did you ever notice how Perry looks like Ferb? And Phineas looks like Dr. Doom Spurts. But anyways, time for number one. Epic Transition. Now, time for number one. Number one is this is the Cleveland Show. Hey, so yeah, Cleveland Show. Cleveland Show was not a a kid show. Fuck, bitch, slut, Browns. <laughs> I'm down with the words. <laughs> it was not a kid show, and um, it was very bad. Not very bad. I mean. It's so canceled now that Adult Swim doesn't even show it. Like, that's how Family Guy came back, Adult Swim showing it. Now, the schedule used to be either it would be King of the Hill, it would either be Bob's Burgers or... I hate Bob's Burgers. Cleveland Show, there would be one of those two. Bob's Burgers on the weekdays, and Cleveland Show is usually on weekends, or they would have Bob's Burgers and Cleveland Show. And then they would have um, American Dad, Family Guy, Rick and Morty. But now it's um, King of the Hill, American Dad, Family Guy... Bob's Burgers, Rick and Morty. So, my voice cracked. I don't know if you heard it on Bob's Burgers. But yeah. So, I keep looking at the TV. So, anyways. But yeah, Cleveland Show was a really good show. It, I mean, they still show. I'm pretty sure they might show episodes. I haven't seen an episode of Cleveland Show in a long time. That's really good. I'm pretty sure it's still on Netflix. And it's just an all together. Really good, really. <laughs> it's all together, really, really good show. The characters, the development, the characters you get into, the deepness of the. It's still not even that deep, but. Taking the character from. It just paused a little bit, you probably noticed that, but don't worry about it. It's from taking. It a transition from Family Guy taking Cleveland, taking him and Cleveland Jr. to. Co not Co Hulk, um. Virginia. Yeah. Was pretty interesting. And then, I him, actually get, like and then him getting married to Donna in the first episode, and then making that joke, that the, bear. making that joke at the end, and then Tim the bear and Holt and Lester, and Lester's fat fat wife and um, the bear's fat wife and <laughs> Holt's mom and Holt's doll. Oh my god, I remember that weird. episode. I remember that episode. That episode was freaking weird. But anyway, but yeah, these were all good shows. Thanks for our top five list. If you liked it, leave a like, leave a comment. We're thinking about sending us. All, all of my subscribe. If you know either me or actually, if you notice that uh, Cleveland show, he was still down the only black guy in their group. There he is. <laughs> but if you know either me or SS in real life, be free to make. I doubt you're going to know me. Be free to make us fan art and give it to me to either marry him and be free to leave a comment down below. We're thinking about doing a reading your comments video. And if y'all have any ideas for intros, we can try. We can try putting them in in our videos. I, we're, I'm gonna figure it out. Yeah, I was, th I was thinking about it's like bets and stuff we can do with against y'all, where y'all end up guessing our or making our punishment up. Nothing too crazy though. We're talking about like um <laughs> challenge videos, Mr. Burps. <laughs> Anyways, we were thinking about doing Betsy. I was thinking about I, I was thinking about it. he wasn't, but I was thinking about it. And also, comment and reading reading your comments. So, if you would like if you like this, we're gonna we're probably gonna make this into a series. Next episode will be our favorite cartoons that are still airing and making new episodes but until the next time we need to stand Com but comment down below if you do want this to be a series or not because we're not just gonna make it if y'all don't want it yeah i mean yeah so 
Until next time, I need to just dial the like button, cut that subscription box, tap that comment section, until it's October, type a little something, something spooky, because he's a pretty spooky guy. And then the next time, I'm DK, that man, I'll share this just right there. Hi. Say bye. Bye. And we are the other day. No, they, they, Oh my god, you just said her old channel name. It's DK, and this is. No. Oh, is it still, is it still rolling? Yeah, it's still going. Alright, so, well, I'm sorry, but <laughs> Tap the like button, like, cut that subscription box, and Halloween, tap the comment section, tap if you're listening to him, because he's a pretty scary guy. Until the next time, I'm DK, that is it, guys. I will see you, no, you will see, no, we will see you, no, you will see us. Take it, put your pants on, in the next video. Bye! And if you can draw, feel free to make us an animation, uh, anything, just pick a video.